Here's the story. Five Yemeni Guantanamo Bay detainees, all captured in Pakistan, now quietly last evening, as Bill said, being transferred. So Doug McElway's on the North Lawn, live in the White House this morning, leading our coverage. Why now, Doug? Bill, that's the question that a lot of people are going to be asking today, and no doubt Press Secretary Josh Ernest is going to be peppered with questions today about this release and the timing of it. Uh, the release was announced by the Pentagon late last night. Their transfer apparently was delayed because it took this long to find two countries, in this case Oman and Estonia, who were willing to take these transferees in. All five were, pack were captured in Pakistan all five were known to fight with al-Qaeda in Afghanistan, and at least one of them was known to have a personal relationship with Osama bin Laden. The announcement of the release, uh, meeting with uh, tremendous anger from some Republicans on Capitol Hill. The President of the United States has concluded that the war on terror has reached a point that we can safely release people from Gitmo. The best I can say about him is he's unfocused. That's delusional thinking. The war on terror has reached a lethal phase, and it is insane to be letting these people out of Gitmo to go back to the fight. You might recall that in yesterday's uh, appearance at a Cedar Falls, Iowa utility, the president made kind of a passing jovial reference to the only two years that he has left in office and that he is kind of in a rush. Well, just two days ago, on a more serious note, uh, Josh Ernest made pretty much the same point when he was asked whether Gitmo would still be open when this president leaves office. Listen up. Well, uh, I'm not willing to concede that at this point. What I will concede, however, is that uh, members of Congress, and this is actually true of both parties, not just Republicans, uh, have put in place obstacles that have made it very difficult for the president to uh, succeed in the goal that he has laid out uh, to close the prison at Guantanamo Bay. And those obstacles may get bigger. Senate Republicans have introduced legislation which would make it much more difficult for the president to transfer these prisoners out of Guantanamo Bay. Wow. Doug McElway, thank you. That breaking news from overnight from the White House this morning.